Now, weeks after the devastating 7.8 magnitude earthquake hit Turkey and Syria and killed over 50,000 people, Turkey has now begun to work to rebuild homes. The death toll in Turkey due to the massive earthquake has crossed uh, over 44,000, while more than 160,000 buildings containing have been severely damaged. President Recep Tayyip Erdogan, who will face elections next month, has pledged to rebuild homes within a year. However, experts have said that instead of building homes quickly, the priority of authorities should be safety. This is some buildings that were meant to withstand tremors crumbled in the latest earthquakes. However, experts say that the risk of earthquake in Istanbul, which is home to 16 million inhabitants, has not increased. Artmadı çünkü tamamen farklı sistemlerden bahsediyoruz. Dolayısıyla İstanbul'da depremin riskinin artması demek 99 depremleri sonrasında bunu söyleyebiliriz. Ama Doğu Anadolu fayında olmuş bir deprem için bunu söyleyebilmemiz söz konusu değil. Böyle bir risk artmamıştır. Erdoğan's government has faced severe criticism over its response to the devastation as well as failure to enforce the construction quality. Government's initial plan now is to build 200,000 apartments and 70,000 village houses at a cost of at least $15 billion, according to reports. Estimated cost of rebuilding houses and infrastructure will be around $25 billion. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.